Welcome to the Mott and Crit Show. I'm here with Max Diakita. We'll have a new feature on the show this year called What Pisses Me Off and What Makes Me Happy. So for the past few days I've been taking a staycation. We went on lots of hikes, recharged our batteries. It has become a tradition to cook a New Year's Eve meal at home, all put together by my lovely wife, Natalie. We'll talk about that in a minute. And we have an all new uh, weekly top 10 coming up, 10 out of 10, I'll tell you about that later as well. So let's get cooking and welcome back to the Mott and Crit Show in 2018. <laughs> Hello and welcome to the Mod and Crit New Year's Eve dinner party. Happy New Year! For many many years I used to always work on New Year's Eve as a drummer playing different venues and uh, I was never home. Lately I've been finding myself at home more and it has become a Gallmeyer and Mod and Crit tradition to stay at home and uh, cook a delicious New Year's Eve dinner mostly devised by my lovely wife Natalie. So let's start cooking! Happy New Happy Year! Happy New Year! Okay, so tonight what we're gonna do is serve a very simple but delicious dish. It's a filet mignon, sautéed shiitake mushrooms and cream of course. A little bit of cream just to make it a little healthy. And all of this is gonna be served over mutton crits, most delicious and silkiest and butteriest Mashed potatoes. That's right, I'm mashing. I'm mashing the potatoes. Now, the centerpiece of our dinner is the filet mignon. Mm, yum. Just very simple. We're gonna put salt and pepper. That's it. And then we're gonna heat up some butter. More butter. So one of the most shocking news already this year has been the uh, plans of the Trump administration to open up federal waters to oil drilling. As a matter of fact, 90% of all federal waters will be opened up to oil drilling and gas exploration. This will have a devastating effect here in California because of the Pacific Ocean and uh, it will just be made available to uh, fracking and offshore oil drilling. Too quickly we have forgotten about the devastating effects of oil spills not so long ago that affected the uh, coast all the way up from Oregon down south to Mexico. Stay in touch with what's going on. Follow NRDC right here is the website. Donate, but most of all, don't get disconnected and give up. Live harder.
Don't text and drive, you're a shitty driver as is. Keep both of your hands on the steering wheel and focus on what you're doing. What makes me happy is all the wonderful people at Sheldrick Wildlife Foundation doing all this incredible work. Welcome to this week's weekly top 10. 10 out of 10 this week, which means I selected one song from each previous 10 shows. It was tough. Um, I had to just follow my gut instinct. In some shows, I wish I could have selected multiple songs, but I wanted to keep it at 10. And maybe in the future, you can let me know what your favorite song was out of each show. And we will put together a top 10 with your input. So for my 10 out of 10, I chose songs that really reflect my state of mind that give you a window to my soul what I felt during that time frame so here we go now mixing this set or mixing any set I like to create a certain vibe and flow and energy that's very important to me and also sometimes you know paying attention to keys key changes uh, so harmonic stone clash comes into play however there's no absolute rule in music ever so use your gut instinct and use your sense of what you think it should sound like so we start the set with lost kings and don't call going into cravings and their song legacy <laughs> As you can hear, there was a perfect place to transition from one song to the next, just using a couple of samples and the crossfader. Next up then is Don Diablo and Take Her Place, and that plays into James Hersey and Miss You. So once again, a great transition. I had to do very little here to help it along. Crossfader, I emphasized some downbeats with uh, extra cymbals and kick drums. But you can take a place tonight. Show me. So here what we did is just a straight cut to the next song. Just go straight into Miss You by James Hersey. Just put in a uh, little rise and that was it. So next up then is Dead Mouse with The Felt and uh, we're going into uh, Yours Truly and it still feels like summer. I know that some of you are freezing out there but here in California it does still feel like summer. <laughs> Dead silence and straight into Still Feels Like Summer, the Adam Turner remix. Next we have Arizona and Oceans Away, the Sam Felt remix. And we go straight into John Lennon and Imagine. No transitions needed here. Now at the end of Imagine we just let the keyboards kind of ring out, the keyboards and strings. And then it goes into Armin van Buren, Sound of the Drums. It starts with an acoustic piano. Just put a little filter on that acoustic piano so it matches the piano in Imagine. And we just let one sustain and the other starts. And the world will Last but certainly not least is Protoculture and Laguna. Now here we actually had some fun transitioning from Armin van Buren's Sound of the Drums into Laguna by Protoculture. Check it out. So as you can hear, we 
extended the vocals, we sampled it, moved it over into Laguna, adjusted it a little bit with a filter to compensate for possible clashes with harmonics, emphasized some downbeats, cymbals, rises, crossfades. So go to Mixcloud.com, turn up the volume, leave us a comment, like us, follow us. Don't forget to come back next week for an all new episode of the Martin Crit Show Weekly Top 10. Happy New Year and a prosperous 2018!